Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do a quick warm-up session. You can do this warm-up before any type of workout or Taekwondo practice. So let's get started. First, you should just hold on to your legs. We are just warming up our knees, our whole leg. You can lift up your leg and hold it close to your body. So lift it up and pull it close to your body. Very good. Now we're gonna do some movement. Lean to the side and to the other side. We are just gently warming up the body. If you want a little bit more deeper stretch, try to lift up your arm when you lean to the side. This gives you an even deeper stretch. You can also do a reach to the side. As you can see, it's a different movement. Now we're gonna lean forward and just slowly go from side to side let the gravity work here gravity is your friend you're just moving from side to side feel how your body feels feel your back breathe out and just try to lean forward you can get into an even deeper stretch if that's comfortable and just feel how your legs feel Now you can hold on to the left leg or to the right leg and pull your body closer. Very good. Now we're gonna transition into a horse stance. As you can see here, I'm just moving from side to side, warming up before a deep stretch and try to sit back. Very good. Make sure that your ankles are not hurting and try to push your knees out with your forearm. Very good. Now we're just going to start moving. Just gently skipping and we're just going to do some footwork and some punching practice. So first just do some forward punches, nothing extra. Then we're going to do some uppercut punches and then some turning punches. Make sure that you keep moving. So you do the forward punch and then you can do it faster like this. Very good. The uppercut punch, same thing and you do it faster. Turning punch and faster. Now we're going to do some more footwork. As you can see here, I'm sideways and I'm moving forward and backward. You can do this little skipping motion if you have a ladder that you can put down or something like that you can practice like that you don't need to have anything just make sure that you're actually moving forward and back now we're gonna do some skipping on both feet and switching sides so switch sides and do a quick switch very good Okay, and now we're gonna do some knee ups. We're gonna step forward and lift up the other leg as close to our body as possible. Very good. Step forward and lift up. Very good. Now switch sides, other knee. Up and back. Up and back. Make sure that your guard is up. Very good, now we're gonna do some knee strikes from the side. Again, we step forward and this is a different type of strike. So you can see this is more to warm up our hips. You can do a full range of motion here. Very good, now we're gonna do some turning practice. So we step forward and turn. This is a full 360 turn. Make sure that when you turn, your head is the first thing that turns. So you have to see first before moving your body. Now we're gonna do a half turn and move forward and backward. Very good. Half turn, forward 
and a backward. Very good. So as you can see here, we are combining different types of footwork and skipping and movement. So it's all a very nice thing to warm up and get you ready. Very good, switch sides, same thing. Half turn and skip forward and backward. Very good. Forward and backward. You can play around here however it feels good to you. Very good. Breathe in and out. Now we're gonna do some leg lifts. As you can see here, I'm lifting up my leg just forward. Make sure that you're not straining anything. Just gently lift it up. And you can try to lift up higher and higher with each move. Switch sides. Same thing on the other side. very good now we're gonna do a similar thing we're gonna do a leg lift but to the side so lift up to the side make sure that the leg that you're standing on stays at the same place this is very good for your hips and your hip flexors and your overall body movement as you can see i'm first kicking in front of me a little bit and then lifting it up this is also very good for your obliques because you have to control the movement let's do it on the other side as well so lift and back very good and then you can try to lift higher and higher with each move make sure that you're still controlling the technique and keep your knees straight follow the motion and breathe out with each movement very good one more and out very good so now we're gonna do some other type of leg lifts now backward this is very important to practice it because it helps you with the balance so try to lift up the leg and as you can see here I'm trying to keep my balance and make sure that your knees are straight and you lift up as high as you can make sure that you try to lift up high and controlled it's okay if you wobble don't worry about it just try to make sure it's controlled movement now I'm gonna do some hip circles and we're gonna do some leaning forward and backward your hips should feel really good now because we managed to warm them up so just gently lean forward and backward make sure your knees are bent when you do this now we're gonna finish up with some full body rotation side to side as you can see here the whole body is moving and breathe out with each move good job thank you so much for watching this video if you enjoyed it please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more videos now you can start your taekwondo practice